it is time for a berserker mail quickie <laughs> in this quick training we're going to talk all about tags save searches and colored labels and how we can use them inside of the platform to organize your contacts and lists of emails. Now, Berserker Mail uses tags to create different segments of your contacts and you can assign as many tags as you want. It's an unlimited setup and you have the ability to use those tags to create different sub lists that you want to email to. We call those saved searches. Now, on the right, you can see the management screen for the save searches. And for each save search that you create, you can define various different parameters, including different footers and uh, which tags are included or excluded from that list, etc., so that you have unlimited control on how you market to your list. One of the things you'll also notice is the blue and red colored labels, and we use those to further organize your data. So let's take a look at a common scenario where you might have a marketing list and also a customer list. Your marketing list may receive daily emails, but your subscriber list to your membership site may have other information that's pertinent only to subscribers that you don't want your main marketing list to see. And you certainly don't want to be annoying your marketing list with subscriber only information. So creating two save searches for this would be the easiest way to segment these two lists. Now there are some no-nos that you just don't want to do. For example, you don't want your customer facing fulfillment emails published in your email archives. You don't want to have those emails that say come join us at the webinar starting in a half an hour there's no value of that being published out in your public archives. So that's something you want to segment off separately. You also don't want to put access links in the footer of your marketing emails, right? So where your customers may want those links to be able to update their billing and shipping address and all of that stuff, and you would want to put that right into the footer for your customer-centric emails, you certainly don't want that in your marketing emails. And this is the reason we would create two separate save searches, one for our customers and one for our marketing list. As we go further beyond just save searches and tags, we can also use colored labels. You can see those colored labels, the blue and the red, in the screenshot on the left from the All Emails section of Berserker Mail. These colored labels can be associated with the save search so that you can very easily and visually distinguish emails between your marketing and your customer emails, for example, and you can also quickly and easily filter them. So when we look at the filtering options, I can just filter the emails for my marketing list and find exactly what I'm looking for quick and easy. I also wanted to give you one bonus tip that's really cool that I personally use, and that is when I receive testimonials from people using my products or services, I create an email broadcast that goes out to a special save search called testimonial. And in that save search, there's only one contact that is tagged within the save search. And that one contact is a private email address for me. So yes, I'm sending myself a single email, but I'm also color coding that to green. And I put some unique text inside of the subject line for that email so that I can easily search and find those testimonials for different products of mine later to use them in future marketing emails. So this is just a creative way that you can use these saved searches and these colored labels and tags to segment data till your little heart is content. I hope you've enjoyed this quick training and know a little bit more now about how to use tags and how to use save searches and colored labels inside of your Berserker Mail account and how you can go berserk with tags. Enjoy!